What's up everyone, it's Russo. I hope everyone is doing well. Please follow my Instagram at Russo Lifts just in case something happens to this YouTube channel. You can follow, message, and you can watch my daily story content on Instagram. I'll see you there. Um, after I got my MRI, you know, I hit him up and I'm saying, yo, I want to do another AKG, an echocardiogram and, you know, uh, see how this uh, fluid with the monoxidil is going, whether I need additional therapy or not. And he says, uh, okay, sure, come. And I was supposed to see him a few days ago. And then he goes to me, like he just disappears. And, you know, I'm calling him, you know, calling him day by day by day, and, you know, no answer. I was like, what the fuck is going on? And then this morning, uh, my dad calls him. And he's like, because um, I was so disappointed. And he and he, the dude picks up. So he like he was deliberately avoiding me. Um and then, like, he scheduled the appointment for tomorrow. And I talked uh, I, I, I talk with him, like, what the fuck? Where, where were you? And he says to me, I got on trend and I got severe depression and anxiety. And that's why I shut myself off. So I'm like, dude, like, I'm trying to reach you out, reach out to you for. And you're probably you like know, one of the only people who would understand what he was going through. No, I, I do. But like, if, if you're a doctor or a cardiologist and you're experiencing if a drug fucks your heart up and you manage to fix it, why the fuck are you taking it again? And if it's like impacting your work, your social life and your professional life, because you've, you've given like a, a hypocratic oath, right? And you're straying away from it just for the sake of taking a fucking drug. What are you doing? Like, that's not a rational behavior. Like, you know, the sh it's, it's, it's a shame. It's the you. super physiological ego that trend gives dudes who have no ego on their own. Right. I get it. But like, why would you go back to something that really fucked with your heart? And that's in your field of expertise, like your yeah. medical. <laughs> or like, that's the, the irony of it. You know, it's not, it's not you or me or some dude down the street, you know, doing this. It's a fucking MD. Full blown cardiologist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that's 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 the the, the, the the irony. And I was like, Jesus Christ! You know that's so. We'll see. I, I hope that he that I find him tomorrow. <laughs> Just I don't know. I'll flip out. But yeah, that's funny. But again, it's the same thing that we talked about prior. It's everywhere. It's even here. It's not that it's exclusive for the U.S. or for people that we know of um, publicly um, it's everywhere, you know, and that is the sport. So um, it's, it's, it's so weird, but um, See, it is like when it is. my career is over, I don't think I'm really going to have an issue downsizing because I'm known for my personality and knowledge. Like, right. I Why spend like, this is like vanity. This is like to prove a point. And then once my point's proven, that's it. Exactly. It's not even that though. Like it just fell in your life. Cause like right now, this body weight. Every day, I'm wondering how 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 are these people that are like five eleven, five ten, five nine, five eight? How are they? How are they like three hundred pounds? Like, you know, when you when you when you see it and when you stand up, uh, you know, rapidly, you get ortho orthostatic hypotension. You have problems with circulations. You have, you know, um, problems with um, pro proper hydration, maintaining you know, osmolarity and, 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 and everything in the body. Um, there are so many things uh, like blood pressure, heart rate, everything that just come with the territory of just being big. Uh,